discovering the true nature of forces and energies, the unity of all of them. One of the most abundant energies which is also the source of life is radiant energy or the light energy in which photons are separated from the sun and hit the planets and we calculate its energy with the following equation. Also, another famous energy is kinetic energy in which an object with mass of m moves from one point to another point. That it can be said that the displaced energy can be calculated by this formula. In fact, the mass of an object can also be written as m is equal to n times m of p where n is the number of constituent photons of this particular mass and m of p is the photon mass. One, gravitational force. If we consider gravitational force, which is the force within two masses, that is actually the effect of interaction between two masses that affect each other and create attraction force between them. If we want to imagine this force, we can say that the gravitational force is the same chain photons that are moving between two objects and it causes the effect between these two objects. Two, magnetic force. If we have two magnetic objects with N and S poles, there is always a magnetic force between these two magnets, which is from N to N poles or S to S swans in the form of repulsive force and from N to S or S to N poles is in the form of attractive. Now, if we intend to explain the structure of this magnetic force, we have to say that the magnetic force is the same invisible chain photons that go from pole N to S. Three, Coulomb force. It is clear that the Coulomb force usually exists between two positively and negatively charged particles, which is caused by the effect of excess or deficit of electrons. Due to the increase of electrons in a certain surface, a charged environment is created, and this surface has a force effect. 
Considering that the electrons are made up of photons, it can be said that this source of charge is the same photons that make up electrons. Considering that charge is the number of electrons and the electrons are composed of photons, then it can be said that the electric charge force is the same effect of the displacement of photons. Four, nuclear force. According to what has already been said about the structure of the nucleus, the nucleus is composed of neutrons and protons that are arranged in a special way next to each other by the Coulomb force. It is clear that the nuclear force, weak and strong, is the same nuclear force between neutrons and protons of the nucleus which are rotating at a speed near to the speed of light and these neutrons and protons themselves are also composed of photons. Result. According to the above contents, it can be said that all forces and all energies are actually different states of photons. For example, let's look at our water molecule H2O, that it has different states like vapor, ice, hail, snow, rain, etc. In fact, all of them are the same water. So, it can be said that all forces and energies are the same moving photons with different structures.